Everybody wants to get there faster, make their way to the top of the hill. Each time you try, gonna get just a little bit better. Each step you climb, one more step up the ladder. Save my Dada from the cancer. That doesn't even look like him. Why does he look like- why does he look like Hefty in that picture? What? Why do he look like he ate like an entire rotisserie chicken and he's bloated? Don't worry about me, I got rolls. Oh hell yeah, alright, we're good. I got roll- look at the fucking- look at the agility on this fucking guy. He used to ride motorcycles and do daring stunts. And now he does fash movement. Oh my god, this is just like Demon Souls. Got him. Yoinked him. And he- he- yep, yeah, yep, yep. This is where Hephaestus is, he's making all the funny chains for Hades. Or I guess Satan, I don't know. Do you think mythology gets kind of fucked up when you get down there in the crusty earth? I don't want McDonald's, you can- uh, 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 What? I don't want- What? Why did I look over- I don't want McDonald's. Uh, okay, go get, uh, A&W. Get a- get a- get an A&W burger and an A&W- A&W root beer. Get yourself a root beer float from a and I don't know. Knock on the door to Burger King and beg them to open. Knock on the front door of the Burger King and fucking kick in the glass. Yell at them to let you in. Yeah, go to an A&W. Go to a- go to a Burger King and ask for a Whopper. Please! Give me Whopper! I have never seen this game ever. Well, come on now, why wouldn't you? As the- okay, as the number one Ghost Rider PS2 streamer, uh, why would you never see this game? Come on now. Expand your fucking horizons, come on now. You- you gotta level- you gotta level up your game, you gotta expand your horizons. If you- if you're not- if you're not experiencing all that the PS2 has to offer, uh, like a game like Ghost Rider, you're really missing out. You gotta expand your horizons. You gotta- you gotta expand your horizons. The horizon is right there, look up dire look directly at the sun. What I'm saying is, look directly at the sun. If you see the sun, what you gotta do is you gotta look directly at the sun. Oh, I have to get him up to like, brutal level to be able to do- like, do damage? Wild. That seems like a pain in the ass. Why isn't there a Morbius game? Well, cause Morbius is like, a loser character. I- I- will say it, I'm not afraid of saying it, I don't give a shit about the Morbius lust. Like, one, shut the fuck up. Morbius, really? Uh, Morbius is a loser character. Even comic book fans don't talk about Morbius. Morbius is Namor. Morbius is like Namor, I'm saying it. I don't give a shit, Morbius is like Namor. Yeah, but Ghost Rider was played by Nicolas Cage, so we had that going for him. And Nicolas Cage is way cooler, way cooler than Jared Leto could ever be. He's a loser, and Morbius is a loser and a freak. Like, I'm not afraid of saying it, Morbi Morbius is a fucking loser. Like, memes aside, he's a, he's a dork and a loser. Nobody likes him. Not really, nobody really likes him. You want- you want to like him. Alright? Nobody ever, 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 ever cared about Morbius before he put on the mask. People be like, I'm Morbin out, dude. I'm Morbin left and right. Yeah? Are you? You're Morbin left and right? Okay, name- name three Morbius comics without Googling it. Right now. Name three Morbius comics. Well, in context of the character, who does Morbius even fight? He's like a Spider-Man guy. And he's not even like a cool Spider-Man guy like Krang the Hunter. He's not Blades, he's not Blades' enemy. He's one of Spider-Man's like 60 different guys. Morbius- Morbius is like one of- uh, one of Spider-Man's 60 to 70 different like fucking guys that he fights. Brendan is Morbius gatekeeping. No, I'm not. Have Morbius, enjoy- enjoy more Morbius, enjoy Morbius. Yeah, Krang the Hunter, Kraven the Hunter. Krang is TMNT. Well, excuse me. Well, excuse me. I like Morbius because I am also- I am Morbiusly obese. I am Morbius- I am Morbius a beast. Okay, here's- here's how they get me to care about Morbius, right? Oh, I fucked up, I pressed the button, oops. Le legitimately, do you want to know how they can get me to care about Morbius? Um, put your favorite Martian in it. You walk into theaters, Morbius starts. Uh, you're sitting there in the theater, and you're like, you know what? I, I think, uh, yeah, no, I think, um, you know, I think uh, maybe, maybe this is gonna be, maybe this is gonna be it. Um, okay. Doing your mom, do it, doing your mom. Doing your morb, do, doing your morb, doing your morb, do, doing your morb. I got a really strong cocktail, so I might be a little buzzed. Uh, I've drank half of it, so I'm sure that by the time I'm done with it, I'll, I'll love Morbius. <laughs> McOrbius. Uh, when are we gonna get the McDonald's Orbius meal? When are we gonna get the McDonald's Morbius meal, the McOrbius? 
I hope it's just like a slab of meat. It's a ball. It's a ball of, like, it's a hamburger patty that somebody's rolled up into a ball. I hope it's just an orb of meat. It is literally a more orb -bias. It's a mick orb -bias. What are the- what are they riding? Are they riding, like, the fucking Gungan speeders? Like, what's happening here? Ah, Annie! Are these- are these- are these corrupted, um, Gungans? Am I fighting evil Gungans? Is this where they sent Jar Jar? Is Jar Jar gonna pop up in the Obi-Wan special? Is Jar Jar gonna pop up in the Obi-Wan special during a dream? I hope the first Force Ghost that Obi-Wan sees, even though Obi-Wan is probably, like, the first Force Ghost or whatever. I hope the- I hope the first, like, Force Ghost that Obi-Wan sees is actually Jar Jar. Okay, 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 I finally catch one of your streams and the first thing I come into is doing you more, but... Yeah, sorry. What, you need more? If my motorcycle has guns, why would I ever not use it? Like, why would I ever walk around anywhere to, like, chain combo attacks if my motorcycle has a gun built into it? That's fucking sick, by the way. I love that. That's a fucking sick slide. I'm getting so many fucking Morbius points, or orbs, if you will. Hey, Brennan, can you say vengeance in a really edgy voice? I am vengeance. I am pain. When you see the shadows, when you walk at night, I reside within them. I'm always watching. I'm waiting for you to slip up. <laughs> Is that- what- what is that, cheating? Are you saying that's cheating because I used a voice changer? Okay. <coughs> I am the one who wakes. I wait for you in your sleep. How was that? I am vengeance. How was that? Is that good? I am vengeance. That one hurts, so. Brennan, you need to wake up. You were watching Morbius ironically and had a stroke. You're trapped in a dream state where Morbius is taking over your every thoughts. If you don't wake up, everything will turn out Morbius. I mean, won't people be, like, happy about that? When did Ghost Rider get a game? Ghost Rider's always had a game. It's on PS2, and there's a Game Boy Advance version of it as well. And the Game Boy Advance version of this game is dog shit. It's like, it's- it's legitimately bad. It sucks, because me and my friends have a running gag called Going Mobus Mode, and we've had that for, like, ever. And now it's like, if I say that, somebody's gonna think I'm making a Morbius reference. If I say I'm going Mobus, somebody's gonna be like, don't you mean you're going Morbius? I'll be it's like, fuck it, I can't, I can't. I can't have fun anymore, fun is dead. I can't believe that Kirby swallowed Nancy Pelosi's desk, became Nancy Pelosi's desk, and then just like, sat there for a month. I can't believe Kirby would do this to the American public. James, don't you ever, ever, ever say that Kirby supports Blue Lives Matter ever again. I will have a conniption fit. Q. Irby. <laughs> Thinking about how I saw a game on Steam uh, called Furry Hitler. <laughs> And then also thinking about how I saw a game made by the same people called Nazi Furries. And I'm just like, okay, Steam, your quality control is bad, I get it. D -d don't There is nothing, there is nothing valuable about this, G don't The first movie I can think of that's Pixar that I really love, probably just Toy Story 1. I have a lot of good memories. No, Bugs Life. Bugs Life had Toy Story 1, and Ants. Ratatouille- oh, you know what? Actually, fuck it, Ratatouille. You're right. Ratatouille came out on my fucking birthday, June 29th. That's how I remember that movie. Oh, what's your favorite Pixar movie? Oh, you know, The Good Dinosaur. I- <laughs> Ants is DreamWorks. I know, I said that just to, like, confuse and obfuscate. Listen, if you ask me what my favorite thing is, Nine times out of ten, I'm gonna put up a smoke screen to trick you. Looking at a list of Pixar movies now to figure out what one's my favorite one. Did I ever tell how I'm pissed off that Disney stole my- my copyright? My IP idea? Sorry. Disney stole my name. My name idea, right? Let me tell you motherfuckers something. When I was a kid, when I was like in third grade, I used to have two stuffed animals. And they both had the same name, right? Well, James, they literally stole your name for Monsters, Inc. Um, they, they, mine's way more important. Um, <laughs> when, when I was, uh, when I was a kid, I had two stuffed animals. I had a, a pet rabbit and a, and like a, like a, like a, like a clownfish, right? Both of them were stuffed animals that I had and I carried them with me everywhere I went. And they both had the same name. That name was Nemo. I named the clownfish Nemo and the bunny Nemo. And they had the same name. And I carried around with me for like for like a, a month and a half straight. And then two to three years later, Finding Nemo comes out and I'm pissed off. I'm sitting there like fucking screaming. I thought Disney mind melded and jacked into my fucking head. I thought they got inside my fucking head. Did you lose them and then have to find them? I did lose 
both of them, and then I found one of them, but it was at my grandparents, so there was no recovering them. Brendan, you're an enigma. My mind is, uh, is a platter of, of gray poupon. More like gray poupon these nuts. Got him. Because, because this is like my job, I don't really watch a lot of YouTubers for my own sanity. What the fuck? What the fuck? How did I do this? How? I don't know if I get out of this. I, uh, we, we can do it. 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 We can Oh, dude, sick grind! Damn, how did I do it again? What? <laughs> okay, okay, we didn't do it that time. All right, who? I would be very fucking afraid if we did it a third time. <laughs> I like that these guys are. Do you think these guys split? Do you think these guys split their mom in half when they get born, or do you think these guys are just like made in a pond somewhere? Imagine if your baby was born with a knife on its back. That'd be- that'd be fucking horrible. Imagine getting a baby- uh, like, imagine a baby that can C-section itself. Sorry, fuck. That's not how that works. My wife's gonna come down and like beat me up. But bro, that baby can do a C-section all by itself. Doctor Baby. You've heard of Boss Baby, now get ready for Doctor Baby. What do you think the demons do when they aren't set- what do you think the demons are doing when they aren't sent to fight you? I don't know, I think they're like hiding inside a refrigerator, giggling. Probably prank calling. I don't know, but like cr watching Crank Yankers. <laughs> oh, dude, why'd you check this out on Hell TV? We're watching Crank Yankers. Of course they're watching, of course they're watching Crank Yankers. Come on. Brendan, would you make a hot dog out of a hot dog out of a hot dog? Brendan, would you make a hot dog out of a hot dog? Like what? Brendan, would you make a hot dog out of a hot dog? You mean like, okay, are you asking would I make a hot dog out of like a sexy dog? Because that would imply that like there is a sexy dog. And I don't want to, I don't want to, like, fucking live in that world. Unless it's like Renamon. No, sorry, no. Brendan, you're better than this. Brendan, you're better than this. Brendan, you're better than this. I was, saw this video on TikTok and someone mushed up a full hot dog and made a brand new hot dog. Why would you do that? If you're gonna make a new, if you're gonna make a hot dog out of anything weird, make a hot dog out of Gerber Life baby food. Like, fuck around and find out. Make something goofy. Get, like, the mashed carrots and potatoes and peas. Mix them all together into a big slurry. And then just, I don't know, try to make a hot dog out of it. I'm thinking about, like, the Reddit posts that lasted for, like, a year where somebody put a hot dog in epoxy. And they just updated it every month. Here's a hot dog. Four months covered in epoxy. Do you remember the video? Do you remember the video... Uh, where, like, the guy takes ramen and he's like, he's like, I'm repairing a toilet using only ramen. But it's like, it's not really ramen. He's repairing a toilet out of epoxy. It's ramen and epoxy, so it's really mostly epoxy. You can't just say you're making a knife out of bone You, if you're using bone and epoxy. You can't say you're repairing a toilet with ramen if you're using epoxy. You're not repairing a toilet with ramen. You're repairing a toilet with, like, epoxy. The sharpest tomato knife where it's all epoxy. Yeah. I just, like, at what point do you get anything out of that? Also, I love elevator fights in video games. Top 10. Top 10 elevator fights in video games. Go. Uh, this one. Half-Life 1. That's it. I'm making a gun out of a gun and epoxy. <laughs> Here we are in Minecraft. Why does every- okay. I'm going to talk about this and like you're all going to understand. Why does every licensed PS2 game have a crystal mine area? I don't know if that's going to blow your mind or not, but why does every single fucking PS2 licensed game, every single one have a crystal mine area? Fucking open season on the PlayStation 2 had one. I was watching the cutscene and I just spilled some of my cocktail. Um Luckily, I only spilled it on my booby mouse pad, so... Safety. Boobies? Yeah, the boobies... The, the, the king of all cosmos, his tits are a little, uh... Soaked... Soaked in vodka. What does that smell? Oh my god. Did you smell that? Do you not smell that? Did Bubby shit? Come over here and smell this. Am I having a stroke? I don't, I don't want to smell whatever No, come smell. over here and smell this. Am I having a stroke? Am I? I literally don't smell anything. I smelled shit. Smell right here. No, right here. Not on the mic. Smell like right here. Why does your microphone smell yeah. damp? I don't know. Yeah. Don't ask yeah. me weird questions. Smell right here where I'm pointing. <laughs> I don't care about that. Smell right here. Smell the boobies? No, smell like right here. Yeah, your mouse pad smells like farts. Why does my mouse pad smell like farts? <laughs> I thought so. Why? What?
Did they put poop in it? I'm like afraid now. What? Why does my King of All Cosmos boob mouse pad smell like farts? More orbs. Morbius. Get it? Oh my god, that did no damage to her. Why did that do no damage to her? Why is her health bar- why is her health pool so large? What if I just hold block? Can she even do anything? Oh, there we go, cutscene. She's doing it, more orb. This is a real Morbius moment, isn't it? Because she's more orbin. She's got more orbin. More- she is morbin. She is more orbing right now. Kind of fucked up, not gonna lie. I finally found the Morbius game. At least it heals you. No, it doesn't. I don't get any heals. The green is your, like, Omega power-up bar. Oh god, I keep falling for it. Ah, oh, shit, I did die. Fuck you! God damn it. Dragon Tamer, you can't just say that for dinner I should have your wife's pussy. That's not feasible. There's not enough calories there. Please, chill. No, that's Dragon Tamer. Dragon Tamer always talks about me fucking their wife. That's like a- Dragon Tamer's like a stream staple, Shelby. Grilled cheese with peanut butter? What the fuck? Got her! Yeah! Shelby, you know, out of anyone, I need- I gotta have my pops. Am I like in an old World War II demon bunker? Like, I don't know what the fuck's going on. All I know is Beyblade, eat hot chip, and lie. Like, I don't know shit. Big guy. Use my big ultimate move. But Bren, don't you want to be a Winamon like Cinnamon? No, I hate Apple Jacks. Or are you talking about Cinnamon Toast Crunch? That's Apple Jacks, right? I fucking hate Apple Jacks. Nasty as fucking cereal. They're disgusting. I would rather eat fetid fart meat. I would rather eat somebody's fetid rotten asshole than eat Apple Jacks. That shit fucking- I hate it. No, Shelby, don't turn around and imply that I'm gonna eat your ass. You ever tried thick water? No, I haven't tried thick water. I've wanted to try thick water for, like, funnies, but I'm also way too lazy to, like, look it up and order it online. Thick water's a thing. It's water that's, uh, thickified. It's thick water. I'm not gonna drink thick wa- It's thick water, Shelby! It's been thickified! It's thick water! People who wanna- Thick water enthusiasts! Me when I'm drinking thick water. <laughs> drink the heavy water that they use to make nuclear weapons. Oh, the heavy water in every single, like, nuclear, uh... Power plant? Oh, it's my favorite. Oh man, I love drinking heavy water. Brittany, you should just eat grass. Listen, Iowans come up with things like fucking Oreo salad and like fruit jelly. God, imagine going to Iowa and catering and being like, okay, can we get some salad options? And it's all fruit salad, which is just wow. jello and marshmallow fluff and pieces of fruit. Or Oreo salad, where it's just marshmallow fluff, jello, and pieces of Oreo. There's so much jello in the Midwest. It's it's fucking insane. Isn't jelly made from fruit? No, jell je sorry, not jelly, jello. Jello. Jelly is made from fruit. Jello is made from hooves. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a hell thing. It sounds like hell. I love that video so fucking much. And we are live here playing some Team Fortress 2. <laughs> it's the best thing in the fucking world. Oh shit, I got into the elevator again. God damn it. And we are live. And we are li And we are live. Let's all spam our live stream fails with mundane Brent Daniel clips. Oh, like me? Oh, uh, man. It, it, get like a three-second clip of me saying, I love drinking water. It's so great, and I like how moist it is. Does anybody else like taking a long, hot shower, letting their muscles unwind as they sit there and let it soak into your pores? Clip that. Post that to our live stream fail. They'd be like, oh, yo, I love water! That'd be so epic. Think, uh, think how much they love, uh, they love water over on Reddit. If you post clips of me on live stream fails, it's gonna be like one person commenting, uh, this guy, isn't he the banner head for mildly infuriating? Reminder that like, f uh, three years ago I made a shit video about how Reddit's like new redesign kind of sucked, uh, compared to the old design. And then our mildly infuriating decided to use the thumbnail for that video as their banner, and I think it's still there. Let me check. It's- it's been like... It's been a couple months since I've checked. Let me see if my face is still on our mildly infuriating. It's not because I'm mildly infuriating or anything. It's just because, like, it's still there. It's still there. My face is still there. 
It's still there! 4.3 million people. Not a single one of them has any idea who I am. I, you know what? You know what's mildly infuriating? That my face is on the subreddit banner for like a video I made like four years ago. You have to let me go are mildly infuriating. You have to let me go. Oh, do they have an invincibility period? Is that why I'm like fucking wasting ammo? Uh, please talk to me if you want to be S ranked on Ghost Rider. <laughs> Sheesh. Don't say V for beautiful. I fucking hate Beautiful Joe. I, do, I, I will tell you, I don't know why to this day. I hate Beautiful Joe so much, but I just do. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I will never understand my hatred of Beautiful Joe. I will never. I hate it. You know what? Get, get, we get to partner this year. I'll play Beautiful Joe. I'll put that on the partner games list alongside Sonic 06. Why would you give the guys with katanas a block, but the guys with the lead pipes a parry? You're just trying to piss me off. Has my bike always been white? Oh, I mean, I guess bone, that makes sense. Oh my God, a normal road. What a fucking crazy thing. Holy shit. Dude, I can't believe it. A normal road. Bike as much as you want. Why does this look like the road in Half-Life 2? Same assets, Brendan. <laughs> Gordon, get him. Smack him around a little bit. Fight these guys in the fucking alleyway. Somebody's doing their grocery shopping, and they peek down the alleyway, and they see this shit. They walk door- they just walk right away. Like, come on. Oh, I need a vengeance co- what the fuck? You want me to get a vengeance combo on these guys? Fuck you. I gotta make sure there's not, like, a heal around here. Is there- there we go, barrel of fire. Spicy. All right, I'm fat and full. Oh, yummy! Gasoline! That's my fucking favorite. Look at this, a simple treat for a guy like me. Yeesh! All right, we got him. I gotta- I gotta go into that gas station. I gotta get some Funyuns. I gotta get a big Texas cinnamon bun. Ghost Rider's always on the road. He's always eating gas station hot dogs. Is this- oh god, this is the part of the- How do I have- uh, We played this for three hours and 40 minutes. How am I just now getting a 2D camera? Like a 2.5D camera moment. I have a genuine fear of clowns. It's just a real thing. I don't like them. Video game clowns usually don't bother me because they tend to make them like way too gross. It's real, uh, like, okay. You know what freaks me the fuck out is, is not like an evil clown, right? I'm gonna show you what freaks me the fuck out. You wanna know what the scariest fucking thing in the world to me is? This is the scariest fucking thing in the world to me. All right, this, this scares the shit out of me. This is the scariest thing in the fucking world to me. Uh, 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 oh, get it away, get it away. Get it away. Close that tab. Never look up clowns again. I gotta remove that from my I gotta purge my desktop now. That's the sky fucking everything in the world. I am more afraid of clowns than almost anything else. This shit, eh. If they're purposefully evil looking, it just doesn't bug me as much. Oh, burgers and hot dogs! Oh, what's well, I gotta kill these guys, and then I get free burgers and hot dogs. Free burgers and hot dogs? Hello? I'd love some burgers and hot dogs. What do you mean old drinks? Oh, cold drinks, the C's cut off. I was like, old drinks? Why are they selling old drinks? Who the fuck sells old drinks? Nah, uh, clown emojis don't scare me. It is, it is like a, a white face paint, big floppy shoes, clown nose, clown hair, scares the ever-loving shit out of me. You must love when carnivals come to town. Uh, I don't mind them as much, it's just when they have like clowns, I'm not going. I do have to scout them out. Um, one time I saw clowns in the Walmart and I, I wouldn't shop for like a week. I saw, I saw like people in full clown outfits at the Walmart in like 2012, 2011, and I wouldn't shop there for a week. Listen, it's not a rational fear, dumbass. You can't tell me, oh, Brendan, it's just a guy. I know it's just a guy. I'm not stupid. Oh, Brendan, why are you afraid of clowns? Like fucking, oh my God, I just am. I can't explain it. It is literally a fucking feeling. It doesn't matter if they're great people, they can take the makeup off and I won't be afraid of them. It's the clown aesthetic. I'm genuinely afraid of it. I'm genuinely afraid. I'm genuinely afraid of clowns. It's something I can't control. It's like it's so. It's I like. It's like having a fear of heights. Being afraid of spiders. It's a primal fear. It is. It is literally. It is fight or flight. And I usually like flight. One time, a girl in my class dressed up in a fully like expensive clown outfit. She walked into the choir room. I ran away. I fell over the railing on the choir steps, threw a table, wrestling style, broke it in half, and ran out and skipped that class that day. 
emailing the teacher, I couldn't do it. I couldn't deal with somebody dressed as a clown. And that girl was also a friend. I have no idea where it came from. I'm assuming my parents put on like the fucking Tim Curry's It or something when I was a kid, like really young, and it just scarred me forever. And it's just a primal clown fear. I don't know where it comes from. I don't know where it is. Same with my like fear of driving. I don't know why I'm afraid of driving. I hate doing it. I don't know where it comes from. 